Hey, what's up guys? How's it going? This is Unhost here from Native Visions, and today I'll be teaching you everything that I know about block swappers. There are three different kinds, and I've got each compact design that I've chosen for this project. The first one here is going to be a wall block swapper. For the second one, we've got a floor block swapper. And last but definitely not least, and maybe the most popular, is the ceiling block swapper. Now behind each of the models, I've got a display for each one. And this just pretty much makes it easier for you to see inside your base how it will look. The first one here will be the wall block swapper, as well as the floor block swapper. And here we've got the ceiling block swapper. It's probably one of my favorites right here. Now since you clicked on this link, you probably want to learn how to make one. So I'll teach you how to make each compact design I've got listed here. The first one we'll do is the wall block swapper. So the first thing you're going to want to do is place your pistons. Place one here. You place your sticky piston right here, and another non-sticky right here. Next thing we're going to do is place our blocks. So you've got one there. Go up one and over. Break that block. Same thing on the other side. Now we'll place whatever your wall will be made out of here, and a piece of glowstone here. Next thing we'll do, place a repeater here. And here, only on one tick, so do not touch them. Redstone dust here and here. Torch here. Another here. And lastly, here. Now the button for your input. And it works like so. Next thing we'll make is the floor block swapper. Obviously, these will be made best underground, but place three blocks. Make a diagonal on each side going to place a torch here, repeater on one tick here, oops, right there, also here, there, and there, torch here, and here, we're going to place a block, and put our main sticky piston here, we're going to place a non-sticky just on top of the torch, so got to be careful, there we go, next thing we'll do is place our piece of glowstone, right here. Now place two more blocks out so that you can put your piston on easily. Again, non-sticky. There we go. And we'll place our input button. You know what I forgot to do? <laughs> Definitely forgot to put our, uh, our floor block on, so there we go. Glowstone. One, two. And non-sticky piston. There we go. Now it should work. So if you place your floor block on, just before you place your glowstone, you should have no problems. Now the ceiling block swapper is made almost identical to the last, and I will show you how to make those. So build up three blocks, break those blocks, build one, two, three, break these two blocks, place your sticky piston, break that block, go in a diagonal up here, one on each side and diagonal on either side, just like the last demonstration. Redstone torch, repeater, repeater on one tick. Dust and dust. We'll have our other torches here and here. We've got a non-sticky piston just on the bottom of this torch here. So just be careful when you place it. Here we go. Now, same with the other side. Glowstone, block, block, break the middle, and place your other non-sticky here. Break that last block, put your input button in, and voila, there we go, guys. All right, well, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you have any questions at all, please leave them in the comments below or send me a direct message. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and watch our other videos. We've got some awesome stuff going on. Thanks for watching. Sayonara and adios.